you took uh, characteristics in women that are usually seen as negatives. Uh, Jen is angry and aggressive and Judy is needy and emotional. And so my question is, um, did you have any pushback in sort of developing these women who would be unlikable? And if so, um, how, how did you deal with that? And how did you make them so absolutely lovable in spite of these traditionally unlikable women characters? Um, great question. Um, I actually wrote an article for The Hollywood Reporter uh, around season one of the show uh, about that answers this very question, which is, you know, did I get pushback? Um, the answer is yes, I did. Uh, there was definitely a fear among, honestly, the female executives on the show that Jen was too angry and that it wouldn't be likable. Quite literally that. Now, I, what's interesting is that I don't consider myself an angry person, nor, nor am I an aggressive person. But when I got that note, it made me really, really angry. And it triggered something in me because though I don't think that necessarily, like, I think at the time I was like, well, I don't, as Liz, as me, I don't really have a right to be angry. But Jen is a fucking widow whose husband was killed in a hit and run that nobody can solve. You know, he was taken away from her kids and he had a fucking affair. Like she has every right to be angry. And I got really defensive almost like on her behalf as if she was a real person. And I asked the executive uh, to, to, to literally take me through the episode and point out to me where I, where she felt the, the character is being too angry. And, you know, and I put her on the spot and it was definitely awkward. And, you know, ultimately I said, no, uh, she's going to be this angry. She has every right to be. Um, I think we have to reshape what we um, can accept as likable and unlikable. And in fact, uh, you know, we never see angry women on TV. Maybe, maybe people, maybe it will be refreshing. Maybe, you know, maybe if we allowed ourselves to be angry, we would, we would, like, you know, accept the fact that like, that's an okay feeling to have. You know, it was a really defining moment, honestly, for me as a, as a, as a woman and as a showrunner, because I couldn't believe I was getting this note from a woman. And, you know, and I was like, we have got to look at ourselves. And, and, and if, if, if we are scared that that's not likable, how is it ever going to be, you know, how are we ever going to move forward? How are we ever going to, um, you know, create characters that really embody the human experience, not just the feminine experience, you know?